you ready to hit the shelves with me? I've got so many prompt tools, I don't know what to do with them. So every month I'm gonna bring you a prompt that comes from one of the many books or boxes and cards, all the different things that I have. This week is a book, it's called Words in Progress. We just used it in our writing prompt party this afternoon and it is put together by Sammy Love You. I'll put a link in the um, little doobly-doo so that you can get a copy of your own if you're interested. I love this book because it's filled with exercises and prompts and it has um, writing space right inside for you. But I'm gonna take a prompt out of here for this week for us to write our story. So let's get started. The book is separated into sections on ideas. There's a section on voice. There's a section on, I wanna say characters, a section on setting, a section on um, getting specific, all different aspects of writing stories. So I don't even know what this is. Oh, this is from the section on getting specific. And the if you have the book, it's on page 104. It's called Zoom In, Zoom Out. So I love this exercise and I think it could really lead to some very interesting stories. It says, when conjuring a scene, it can be immensely helpful to try thinking like a film director. Directors have the ability to move the audience's eyes around the scene to whatever they choose. You also have this power in your writing. Write about a large crowd in an open space, soldiers on a battlefield, protesters in a march, fans at a music festival, children in a schoolyard, or something else from your memory. Begin with a sweeping view of the scene, then work your way in to describe something tiny in the scene that symbolizes the larger crowd. For example, a flash of, cold, of a cold metal sword, a bright feather from a carnival outfit floating up and up. And then the other thing that I really like about this book is that for pretty much every exercise, there's a little tip. And the tip for this one says, to help achieve this effect, you might choose the perspective of someone watching from afar, moving them closer until they are in the crowd. So very visual, I'm a very visual sort of thinker and writer myself. So um, this particular exercise appealed to me. So I wanted to try it out this week. And then next week I will come to you with a homegrown writing prompt tool that I am in the process of making. I'm almost done, but for now we're gonna work on this. We're gonna zoom in, we're gonna zoom out. We're gonna start with some very large crowd of people and find that tiny thing to focus on to focus our story on. And uh, yeah, it should be fun. So happy writing. And check out the video that I just dropped in here for you for further inspiration. If you head over to the, the YouTube page, you'll see playlists of all the different podcast episodes and previous prompts that we've done here on the page uh, so that you can continue to be inspired all week through. Good luck. Happy writing. See you next week.